Security staff for each block, please report to the staff room immediately. Well, a very good evening to you wherever you are. I do hope that you can join me Hello, in appreciating this truly beautiful evening. A night that is absolutely ideal for a game of football. The scenes here really are something. A beautiful picture under the floodlights. Traffic and transport round here. Not the kindest, but regardless of that, the fans have found a way of getting here. There is a sense of theatre and the decibel levels are rising entirely unique this place has something special about it la bombonera and now lining up Spain, for Spain have chosen to go 4-3-3 four, three, three. Four. Jim how do you see it Pantone. well a system promoted by the rise of Coca football 15. Peter the wider players in the front three are, are key operators in how it all works on and off the ball. They have to provide for the central striker, of course, and protect their fullback, so they'll get few breathers. If these two don't make a good impression, there are quite good replacements on the bench. pick out as the telling individual today yeah Keylor Navas he could make all the difference because he's such an excellent shot stopper it's not just a matter of reflexes though it's the way he spreads his body in front of the ball preventing strikers from there's the hit it's loose and there's a race for the ball oh nearly but nearly is nothing can spring out of defence. Moved on forwards. Carvajal. Has a shot! And for a moment, time stood still. Laporte to Jordi Alba and it's Pablo Sarabia Koke and it's Jordi Alba over to the left goes for the header great effort he flew in with courage a good attempt the ball was at a, a lovely height too And here's Morata. Okay. Oviedo. If you have just joined us, well, you've missed no goals. Pass just lacking in accuracy. Busquets. And that's been intercepted. 
And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. And the shot! Oh, he's managed to get it all wrong. That was created because of good, lively movement, which pretty much dictated the pass. Pedri. Morata. Tejeda. It's been intercepted and that will come to nothing. Ball's gone out of play. Now here's the delivery. Laporte gets it away. Pablo Sarabia. Koke gets his pass away. And it's played forward. Oh, no joy with the long ball that time. Koke. Now it's Morata. Oh dear, less said about that pass, the better. Pressing is high and relentless. Oviedo. It's an inviting looking ball that. Pedri. It's Koke. It's Pedri. Tejeda. Okay. Now it's Morata. Oh no, no circumventing this opponent. He's gone down, but the climbs up big. Goal, Spain! And it's Spain who take the lead. It is a good finish. The odds were against him. Little matter. Ferran Torres demonstrated great strength there. I mean, he really had to hold his man off and just cleared enough room for him to be able to get the shot away. And I think it's just top, top play. Spain take the lead, 1-0. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Nice interception, his positioning was spot on. Okay. Spain disappointing in the end there. They lack urgency. Ooh, can he get onto this? Final ball not quite right, and his teammates are irritated at that. Pedri. Well, there was an element of promise insofar as they kept the ball well, but they did very little with it. Pedri. And the two sides separated by the game's only breakthrough moment to this point. 1-0 the score. Well seen, saw that coming. And it's Campbell. Good spot, he's seen the run. Well, it's a move of great promise, will but will it really prove productive? Time. Whistle's gone, that's uh, foul. And he is going into that little black book.
Busquets. And the referee brings the first half to a close. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but one that still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain their momentum now and finish the job. Spain head for the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. Please welcome everyone, our lads. So off we go once more. Well, it's been tight, Peter, but I'm expecting things to, to open up now and we get some free-flowing football. Busquets. Koke, who's set up one goal so far. Petri. Tejeda. No, again, there's no way through. Oh, that's a key interception. It's an inviting-looking ball, that. Campbell. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Busquets. Koke, and it's Jordi Alba, and Pablo Sarabia, and it's Pablo Sarabia, interesting ball, can he get onto this? Great leap! Oh, terrific save from the keeper, well you can't ask for much more than that, a difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Spain, corner number two then. He's done very well to get to that. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. The defending has become, all of a sudden, very personal, up close, adhesive. Well, he's been dropping into space and spraying balls all over the pitch, so enough seems enough now. Koke. The attendance for this match Ferran was 44,070. Excellent challenge there, uncompromising. Are certainly playing with an intense focus in executing their plan here. Koke. And here's Morata. Great defending, strong and determined. Pops for safety. Forwards and with intent. The pass has gone astray. Pedri. Sergio, what are you thinking? Well, I'm inclined to feel that if I was in that dugout, I'd want the players to, to get on the front foot and grab another. Just try to, to make this one safe. Campbell. Oh, this is a very good run. Is there any support? He might not need it. Koke. Costa Rica showing a little more urgency now and to be honest Peter this is what's required this is a really front-footed approach well the question now is whether they can sustain it Koke he's lost the ball there great tackle 
Good pressure. No shortage of purpose here. Yeah, we get to see this more and more. Defenders popping up in these positions. Costa Rica might just end up kicking themselves after that. If they're lucky enough to get another, it has to count. Morata. Now that's been intercepted. Move forward and quickly so. Oh, that's well spotted. And they're not going to make any further progress now. Oh, and he's through the middle. He's shifting through the gears here. Costa Rica really are showing all the necessary urgency, but it's potency they need. Could have been dangerous, but it came to nothing. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. And here's Morata. Now there's a fine ball. Plenty of appeals, but the referee is not interested. Oh, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Substitution for Spain. Number five. Number 22. Pablo Sarabia. Coming on the field. Poor pass that. Sloppy. Number 16. Asensio looking to penetrate Number opposition 12. lines. He's got away. Asensio. The pressing's intense and it's paid off. Spain can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. Added time is up and there goes the whistle. What a game. End to end, it flew by and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Ferran Torres picking up the Man of the Match award and no surprise there. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? And there's a lot more to read into this game than just the scoreline. And with that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening. With the owner of a blue car parked outside the stadium gate, kindly remove it as it is about to be towed away.